Hey guys, Coach Jorge here. In today's video lesson, we're going to be talking about the three speeds at which you can hit the ball, three different power levels of speeds. Now, we have another video on the site here that talks about the five power levels. This one's a little different way of explaining it if you like it better. But basically, uh, there's three speeds and they're going to be defined as this. So Marty, um, level one of speed is just very slow, very ugly. It's whatever you have to do to make me play bad. So now we're really actually hitting soft and you're entering an area I call sabotage. So show me your, um, your ugly ball. Yep, this can, have, this can be a push, a slice, just no pace. You want to be the guy that people hate to play against because the way you're sending the ball back. Remember, this is an important concept. You don't always want to be thinking about what you like. Too many rec players, that's, well, that's the only thing they can think about. Uh, it's about me, I want to hit hard, I want to hit my endorphins and get my bloodstream all happy because I'm hitting well. Bull, what you really want is to win. All right, so that's, that's just one level. We call that um, level one. Now level two is the next level up, it's gonna be more power. And the definition of this level, Marty, is it's whatever speed you can hit at and get 10 balls in a row. Okay, so show me what that might look like. Okay, so that's a pretty good hit. And I can test this. I can help my player define uh, what this level is for them. It's what I, this is your ball that you're going to hit most of the time, and Marty hasn't missed yet. So I think she's pretty accurate that this could be level two for you, Marty, called the rally ball. Okay. Now level one, and this is where problems start to happen for rec players, um, is harder. Um, it's as hard as you can hit it and still get it in three times. All right. Now. A lot of people say, well, I'd like to hit hard, coach, man. I mean, this is what I want. I want to hit hard. But if you can't get it in three times, then you don't own that speed, okay? So this speed, Marty, we call it, um, you know, level three, but it's really as hard as you can hit. So go ahead and take a little more risk. Okay, that was in. That was in. Another backhand. Okay, well, you see, there you made two out of three. So I'll give, I'll have her, I'll test her again. Go ahead. There's one. There's two. Okay, there's three. She's clubbing it. Okay, see, that time she did it. So just with a simple testing of three at a time, these are the barometers by which you're measuring these levels, you can determine what these three levels are. So really from bottom to top, again, level one is just the ugly ball. You're entering sabotage. You're just worry, worried about, not you, but making me play bad, giving me nothing to work on. These are the skills I call sabotage. Level two is your rally ball. You should be able to make 10 in a row. So do yourself a little test. Give yourself 10 balls. If you can't make 10 balls, that speed you're hitting at is too high. It's not your rally ball. And then level three is more of the offensive, call it power level three ball. And this is where you can make three in a row. You're gonna go ahead and open up the, the gas pedal and wail on it a little bit more. All right, so those three speed levels are really helpful. Uh, you can use them if you want on the court. And the key is just to kind of do an audit of yourself and see you know, what's good for you and what you really are. I think you'll be surprised. Most people can't hit as hard as they really want. They can't make three, but they just keep doing it anyway because it's fun. All right, so thanks for watching, guys. If you're looking at this on both of our websites, we have it, tennisdrills.tv, our coach's website. Also, jorgecapistani.com. That's our free website for players. And if you're watching it there, make sure that you scroll down and leave a comment in the comment section. We'd love to read those. I respond to your questions. And I really appreciate you checking us out. And good luck to you on the tennis court.